good morning vlog. It has been quite a while since the last time I uploaded a video. This may come as a surprise or be confusing to some people, but Colin and I ended up moving again. I'm not really going to get into why we moved in this video. It's just a very long story that is upsetting. <laughs> so instead, I'm just going to film a day in my life now that I am a mom to a newborn. Colin just got back from the gym, and now he's going to work. Yes, work is work is what comes next. Colin likes to leave me alone with the baby during the day. Yeah, that's my favorite thing. But it's okay, because he gets up for her first thing in the morning. I prepared you a bottle to feed her already. It's already in the fridge. I know. Thank you. Our living room is kind of a mess because we had dinner on the couch last night. So I'm gonna quickly clean this all up before Junie wakes up. So I just heated her up a bottle because I heard her wake up and cry a little bit and then I just walked in to go get her and she's fast asleep again. So I'm going to wait for her to wake up again before I take her out and in the meantime I will be drinking my electrolyte water. only six weeks old and she sleeps through the night and has been sleeping through the night pretty oh. much since birth. Remember even in the hospital she slept from like 11 p.m. to 5 in the morning and then for about the first two or three weeks she'd sleep from 10 p.m. to like 4 or 5 a.m. and then for the past two or three weeks she's been sleeping from 10 p.m. to 7 a.m. every single night. It's very consistent and I feel so blessed to get the amount of rest that I do. It's, you know, the most important thing in order for anybody to function is to sleep, so. Right now would usually be the time that she falls back asleep and takes another nap. But she's very awake and very smiley. So we're just gonna... <laughs> Just gonna hang out on the couch and I guess watch some vampire diaries until she gets tired and then we can put her down for a nap. I'm exhausted right now. I don't know why. I slept really well last night. But... You have something to say? What? So Juniper is asleep right now. I switched the laundry and then I pumped some breast milk and ate some breakfast. So now I'm going to open up a package. I wanted to get color changing light bulbs because we like to read at night with red light. Red light like promotes healthy sleep or something. I also like to have the yellow color on because normal light bulbs, I can't find any that like have a yellow 
tint naturally. All of them have just like a bright, bright white tint and that kind of artificial lighting like doesn't look good to me and it makes me unhappy. So that's why I got these light bulbs. They're from the company Govi. Um, they're Bluetooth operated. I got them from Amazon and I think I'm gonna have to stop recording so I can set them up with the app. So I set up the lamps. They're connected to my phone and I can customize the colors that they are. Did you find the box? Are you trying to sit in that tiny box? <laughs> hey guys, it is the next day. Um, I stopped filming yesterday just because we weren't really doing anything interesting. We just had dinner. Um, so I'm continuing the vlog today. Right now I am leaving my apartment to go to CVS because I need to get some different vitamins. Um, because I'm very anemic and it's gotten worse after giving birth and also my postpartum hair loss is like starting to get really bad. Like I have a couple bald spots so I'm going to try to get some vitamins and hopefully restore my, my hair growth. I don't know how well it's going to work but I have to try so that's what I'm doing now. So I'm back from CVS and I'm going to show you guys some of the things I got. So I do have to call my doctor and make sure that I'm allowed to take these in these amounts while I'm nursing, but I got some vitamins. Um, first is vitamin D3, next is iron, and I also got biotin to support my hair growth. I also got a satin like hair cap because I use the Olaplex 345 system and my friend Jess told me that the th number three works better if you leave it in your hair overnight. So I obviously don't wanna ruin my bedding. So I'm gonna try this tonight. And I also got this shampoo that's supposed to reduce hair thinning because obviously I'm losing my hair. So there's kind of one little bald spot. I don't know how well you can see it. And then there's other parts of my hair where it's thinning. You can't, you can't really see it when it's just down like this, but if I put my hair in a ponytail, you can see there's a lot more spots. I'm gonna update the vlog on what you have done today. Um, I had a couple calls. Which are good. One was a coaching call, the other one was a sort of a brainstorming session call. I don't know what you call it. But, uh, yeah, it's been a good brainstorming day. call. Look how nice our picture frames look in the back. Our portrait of Dwayne The Rock Johnson. He is the centerpiece. We build all of our style around him. Nursery is also Colin's office. We, we're using the room for two purposes. This one's a nursery. I mean, it's big enough. Let me, let me give you a tour. So when you walk in, this is her little clothing dresser organizer. To the left is her bassinet, then her changing table, big window, and on that side is Colin's little work setup. Good morning, sleepyhead. Good morning! Oh, someone's hungry. I think it's so funny how she covers up her face while she eats. I stopped breastfeeding a few, maybe like three weeks ago, just because it takes her so long to eat and she's hungry again in like an hour. It's just not as efficient as bottle feeding. Um, and unfortunately, I think because I stopped breastfeeding, my milk supply has gone way down. Even though I'm still pumping every day, I don't think that pumping releases the same amount of hormones that breastfeeding does. So my milk supply is going down and we've had to supplement with formula, 
we got this really nice goat's milk formula from like Switzerland or something, so that's what we're using. But I kind of want to try to start breastfeeding her again a little bit because I just prefer giving her breast milk. It causes less spit up and I don't really know what to do, so. I put you guys in my cabinet, so I apologize for the lighting, but I'm about to open our Target boxes. This first package is a giant blanket I got for our bedroom because we don't have a blanket in there and the only blanket we do have is like a cheetah print and I'm over it. I'm over it. This goes much better with our bedroom aesthetic. So it's just this enormous chunky knit blanket from Casa Luna. Very, very excited. It was very portable and it's huge. This is what it looks like. It's very, very soft. I'm kind of obsessed with it. I forgot to film an outro for this video, so thank you guys for watching. Like, subscribe, comment, and stay tuned for the next one.